everyone, I'm Caitlin DeRocher with Red Carpet Report at the LA Area Emmy Awards. Here you are talking to every <laughs> diva in Los Angeles news. And now you've got the biggest. <laughs> I love it. I'll take it. <laughs> so why are you here tonight? I am here for three reasons. The number one reason is to celebrate my team, our NBC4 team, on all of our nominations. The second reason is that I'm nominated myself, so I'm very excited. And the third reason is that I will be presenting. I am first out the bat. Oh, okay. That's exciting. Are you prepared? Start with the best, Caitlin, and then it's all downhill. I mean, this show is going to go to hell. Hell in a handbag. You heard it here I mean, first. Gonna, I didn't say it's it. It's going to go down so fast. You know, here we are at this beautiful venue, and it's like, Robert, we want you to kick things off. And I was like, but where do you go from here? So the I only have to stay for the here. first 10 minutes, right? Then I can leave. I love everybody I'm good. behind you rolling their eyes like, oh, my God. So the story that you're nominated for, tell me about it. Oh, it's not. It's a compilation. Oh, okay. It's a compilation okay. of all my work. This is a category that is the best reporter category. It's called Best Outstanding Hard News Reporting. Uh, I feel that this is, for me, a ridiculous honor because the four people that are in this category are not only friends. Two of them I work with at Comcast, and they're all people that I admire so much. And this year, they've done, which was not a wise thing, Academy, this year they've given you the opportunity to watch your friends and your uh, your fellow nominees right. reels and their nominations and what they submitted. Ooh, okay. So when I watched it, I was like, well, this is easy. You're going to lose. <laughs> so I was like, this is fine. No problem. So in a way it was better, but you know, you killed the suspense for me. <laughs> That's so funny. You're like, nah, now mine. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, exactly. But, but truly it's, it's a thrill. It's a, it's a thrill. Well, it's, congratulations. It's in, yes. Thank you. I mean, you know, of the 200 people that are in this market, mm -hmm. to be in the small company, it's it's great. And I know I got lucky, and, and I'm thrilled to be there once again. And it's okay. I know that this year may not be my year, but, you know, it keeps it keeps me trying for the next year and the next year. That's all you need, right? Right. And I'm going to be rooting <laughs> for all four of them. I'm going to be thrilled no matter what. That's amazing. When you were my age, starting out as a journalist, did you ever think wow, that you would be nominated for this? your age. So, what, 12 months ago? Oh, of course. Uh, yeah. Go ahead. <laughs> did you ever picture yourself being here and nominated for such an award? Never. No. Never. I will tell you the one thing that in my career, the best decision I have made, um, I was born in the Midwest. Mm -hmm. I went to, oh, where? Michigan. Oh, Ohio. Oh, okay. okay. But my parents, my whole family went to the University of Michigan, really? so we're diehard Wolverines. Okay, so good, so good. if you're thinking it's going to be I Ohio State. That. <laughs> born in the Midwest, educated on the East Coast. Mm -hmm and then worked on the East Coast and then came to Los Angeles, mm -hmm. the one thing is, this is the best television market in the nation. Absolutely. And I can get on my soapbox and tell everybody why and tell all my cynical friends back East and tell all my friends in Chicago and Miami and Baltimore and wherever. But there is nothing like LA. Mm -hmm. No one has the diversity that we have mm -hmm. when it comes to telling stories. Mm -hmm. And bottom line, folks, we do live shots at 11 o'clock in the winter, and it's 75 degrees out. So, I mean, how can you beat that? that? Yeah. <laughs> They're in the snow. Like, why did I ever choose this profession? So that's the wisest thing, Caitlin. The wisest thing I can say is I, I would, I'm so happy I'm here because the wisest decision I made was to stay in L.A. Mm -hmm. um, years ago, decades ago, when my agents were constructing my career, and they said, you know, the serious reporters, the serious journalists go back east. Mm -hmm. The network plucks from back east. It's like, Why? No. I mean, LA is where it's at. And, and this is a fascinating market. And it is just unbelievable. We've got natural disasters. We've got murders. We've got high profile politics. You know, we've got it all here. And, and I'm so glad I'm here. And I recommend anyone starting out. We may be number two, but you want LA to be number one in market of choice. Absolutely. When your career goal, trust me, well, I'm glad I'm here then. Yeah, and I'm saying this to everybody who's just starting out because by the time you get here, I will be retired. <laughs> well, thank you so much I'll for be talking. Long gone, me. So it's hey, right. that's okay. I'll, we have yeah. that on tape though, so it yeah. doesn't matter. Yes. <laughs> thank you so much for talking. Me enjoy your night. Thanks. And congratulations. Caitlin. Thank you so much. Nice meeting you. Bye, everybody. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, hit the thumbs up and subscribe, and leave me a comment on who your favorite reporter was.